was just trying to think of a good name for the six minute short. We'll have to think about it's it. It's me, Sylvia, for six minutes. <laughs> <laughs> It's me, Sylvia Miles. When you get your shirts from the laundry, do they have cardboards in it? I need some cardboards, like, you know, to because I have to send out this fan mail, and these guys don't send it. I don't have any cardboards. Bye. Here we are going to see Sylvia, Sylvia. Miles, 19L, who introduced us We're together. So She'll be standing right at her door, I guarantee it. Just watch. There she is waiting. <laughs> Hi, Larry. Look, that's all her fan mail here. Just that she. I mean, that's all fan mail, unanswered. This is not fan mail. This is press. But is there anything else in here, Eric? That I keep, see, I keep forgetting to show you things. Move this whole thing. I, no, I couldn't. I stuck it oh, now. I, I stuck it. I would have asked you to move it out. Mm -hmm. But and look at this! I had so much. I had to put a rack in my. Oh my this God. is incredible. And look at this gorgeous view today. Well, this isn't the room to get the view from. But there aren't so many Eric things in here. But here's an Eric thing. An Eric thing. Right here. You're wearing my birthday this, present to you, which I brought. Where did I bring it? I hand delivered it, it all the way to Wales. To Wales? No, to Chester, England. Ch to yeah. to Wales, where I was playing. And that's another piece I gave Sylvia. So, what else is in here that I gave you? The most important piece, Sylvia. Is the Oscar. Did you get the Oscar? I want, you know. You see the Oscar, Lawrence? Oh, yeah. Look at that. Let's go have a drink and then you can photograph mm -hmm. all of the Eric. Jeff Stride, 93286, Woodlake, Southern California. 15 year old kid wrote her this letter. She is dearest Sylvia Miles. Hello, how is life treating you today? I pray this letter has found you in the best of health and happiness. Please permit me to introduce myself. My name is Jeff Strider. I am 15 years of age and attend high school here in Woodlake, California. I'm currently enrolled in drama and I'm taking night classes at our local college. The class is film history. Miss Miles, you are without a doubt Hollywood's adorable, likable, and amusing star ever. Your offbeat leads are both enjoyable and thought-provoking. You are at your best as a thoughtful but vulnerable eccentric vulgar floozy <laughs> or, a sarcastic, or a sarcastic second lead. No matter what role you are portraying, you are always effective, believable, and brilliant. Truly, you are a rarity among stars. No other star is comparable. Your talent is, is unique, a style all your own, a treasure. My favorite film of yours is the 1969 classic Midnight Cowboy. You're great in this film. My second favorite film is your 1975 classic film, Oh My Lovely. You are radiant in this great film. But I also have collected and do enjoy the last movie, 1970, Who Killed Mary? What's Her Name? 19, Heat, 1972, The Sentinel, Parish, Zero to Sixty, The Fun House, Critical Condition, Wall Street, Crossing Delancey, Spike of Bensonhurst, She Devil, and Terror in the City, 1966. I wish the hell I had that. Wow, what a career you have. Like I said earlier, you're a treasure among stars. In closing, I'd really appreciate an autographed photo. And bah, 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 God bless you, Mr. Miles. With love, happiness, peace, and health, your pal always, Jeff, 15 years old. So you know that he's going to you know, hope he grows up fast and gets a job so I can work for him. <laughs> When you came here, here that quick, get this is an Eric that you didn't get yet. Here, come in. So Whoa. you know, you okay, guys, you pill. really I know. You, know, you really have to watch oh, and there's too much stuff. Okay, this you got? Yeah. Huh? You got that? Look, I finally managed to do it without that bl rubber, black rubber thing I didn't like. Yeah. I got it on here with that. Stuff. And there's the banana. And there's the banana I repaired. I broke it and repaired it myself. Oh, yeah. So you got, Eric, okay. you have to really, I I'll tell you, no, no, because okay. if you, um, I'm not covered if you go down and break your head or anything. I'm not covered. Oh, hold on, look. Yeah, but you know, this doesn't have enough. I don't know how to get that. Don't back up. You I'm know, not. You, you know you are backing up. You can't back. No, I this isn't that. it. Get it from here. It's not the way I have it arranged. 
And look at I'm on the VIP shelf, okay? We're on the VIP shelf. Okay, wait. And another one over <laughs> Oh, hold on, Sylvia. There's more over here. The okay. Mickey Mouse watch. The talking Mickey Mouse watch. Where is it? You, but then only there it you is. Know, you see, if you back up and with this, you're going to knock everything off of everything. Yes. Look at this. This it, After I put 75 pieces together here, I put that, that nail polish on oh, it. Oh. And look, it looks great. What kind of glue do you use? Goop. I told him about goop. Isn't that a beautiful how I made it? I love that. Where do you get it? In the hardware store, it comes in household goop, plumber's goop, uh -huh. get household goop, because that takes care of everything. Uh -huh. Can I tell you something? You can do plumbing with it. <laughs> it's unbelievable. I know. Better than crazy goop? You need to do a commercial oh, it's for goop. different. The thing about goop is... Everything I'm wearing has been repaired by goop. You could, it, whereas crazy glue, first of all, it's miserable. Now I don't care how well you do it; you always get so it. Goop on. is easier to work on. Goop is great because you know it's it's like a big rubber ball. If I could show you things I've repaired, you would not believe what I've done with goop. I know. I mean, I believe you. No, nobody would believe it. In other words, Sherry, they told her that it would cost her six hundred dollars to repair this vase that was worth maybe five hundred dollars. Excuse me. So she, I said, give it to me. Just don't ask me when. When I one night I'll wake up and I just have to. That's my hobby is to repair things. She can't find the spot. She's afraid to touch it because she doesn't remember where the spot was. That's how fabulously I would be because the goop turns colorless and then you can paint it. Uh -huh. And then I have little painting sets, children's painting sets that I use. This is my, like, if, if, let's say this, which you understand? Everything here is broken. Hmm. Every single thing was broken. But then what I do is, after I the, get the glue, I then paint the glue. Here, here's a piece. See, I paint the glue. Now, this is called liquid nails. Oh, I've seen that. And this is the goop. <laughs> liquid nails is molding, ceramic tile, picture frames. Forget it. The goop. Oh. I, this is household goop. This is the best thing that ever existed in the whole world. Now, I'll show you. Not an Eric. Look at a Sylvia Miles. I conned this off the guy, and all of it was off. This his brother's a drag queen. His name he's blonde, and he was gorgeous and cute from uh -huh. Mississippi. See, these were all off, and I put all these. Oh, that's great. Isn't that great? Well, let's see. Show it to me. I enjoy repairing things. You had what? I had a little prick here with. <laughs> what kind of prick? He is a prick. And he is wearing, the prick is wearing glasses. This prick broke. Is this anybody you know? This prick broke. And would you believe these These are repaired? The legs are repaired with goop. Look at that. Because where am I going to find another one, right? There are lots of pricks in this town. Well, yeah, but not the last <laughs> two. A to toast. To your marvelous presence and to good health. Okay. And to introducing Lawrence hey. and me. Hey, you did a good thing. He's a sweetheart. It's a mitzvah. Well, I know, but you knew that. You knew it was going to work. It's a shidach. No, I knew you guys would be best friends. I even said, do me a favor, please. Don't become, be best friends. Because this is, to be, to lose Friend, you. Friends are lo Love is you lose. That takes five years before you can be friendly with them. And who's got five years, you know? Right. Who knows? Right. So best friends is the best way to be. Because it's always good to get friendly. You no, know, because you, right, say right. you can enjoy things together, whereas the other way, what good is it? It doesn't make any sense. Nobody can, this is what the whole world, this is why the whole world is suffering. Real love, real love transcends all barriers of all kinds. You know what I mean? And that's really, friends, are the most important thing in the whole world. I don't care what anybody says. Yeah, I don't right. care who they are. Who would know they don't you, know. Right? Who would know better than me? <laughs> if I didn't have my friends, that's, I don't even want fans. I want friends. A friend, because as horrible as we all are, we're good to our friends. We come through for our friends. We do, even in spite of Monday, 6.30 p.m. It's me, Sylvie. I just called you back because I actually...
repaired that earring. A miracle. It, it's like brand new. You can't even tell that it broke because there's a new crazy glue with a tiny drop on either side of that thing. I just pushed it and then I put that thing, pushed it through, bent it around just like a professional jeweler and I fixed it. How about that, huh? I have to show it to you because it's one of the great monumental jobs I ever did. It's like a really professional thing. 